we now have a new art show at the Maynard Library called Friends that will run for the month of February. So we start over here with the list of all the friends. The first one we have is Terry Herring's niece, Rachel, who did a mezzo tint. Then we shift to Doreen Sullivan from Acton, and she did a um, oil here called Surveying the World. And then Ryan, I think her grandson, a seascape Narragansett Beach, mother and daughter. And the one that I think is best is Jessica with Orla, Great Tones in the Flesh. We shift to Brian LeBeau, who did this wonderful lighthouse in Rhode Island, and then Smith's house in Jamestown, Rhode Island, Narragansett Beach in Massachusetts. He recently did this up in Maine, and then a Stowe landscape in Vermont. Now we shift to Tom Craig, he did Brookline Reservoir. And then the largest painting that we have here is um, Lee's Bridge in Concord and Lincoln. This is a Canantum um, landscape. Then we go to Tom's mother. It's an abstract painting, which I think is uh, very much of a likeness of her. We shift to Sharon Santillo's collage. Lovely to sleep to the sound of water. Moonlight school. On a train heading east. Quintessential Connecticut. Interesting that the church is floating. And then Bridge of Flowers, which I believe is in Sherburn, Sherburn Falls. This is by Jen Burke uh, of um, Stowe Flowers. And then she did this of apples and her son did the one at the bottom when he was only four. And then we have another uh, painting by Jen Burke. Then we shift to Ka Katie Caston who did this uh, springtime in the mountains in oil and glass lake. Um, and lastly, a colorful seascape. The last ones are by Emma Fitzsimmons, who is still in high school. Uh, she did these faces, um, three of them. And then she did this face, and this face, and this face. And they all look like that. And the rest of the room looks like this. <laughs>